So hi friends, this is Amit and you are watching my channel Information and Educational Video. As today was the last date of VIT Triple E 2023, so here I would like to discuss what to do next because I don't need many of you need the review of the paper because it is already done. There is no next exam, but the paper was difficult. That's what I can tell you for today's exam as well. Many students have provided me, so you will get the benefit in the form of rank. That is, you will get a better rank at less marks also. So that will help you in the counseling process. So here I would like to discuss what you can do next that is obviously after result you will be doing the counseling process so how you will do that that's what i will be telling you completely so please try to listen my word so that up to the admission is done you will not face any type of problem so first of all vit counseling is not easy if you have the experience of vit counseling then only you can do other counseling and vit counseling are having lots of differences here phase wise counseling will be done not round wise here category wise fees there yeah it is unlike of other uh, counseling process so on 26 you will get the result as of now that is tentative date that may change once it will change i will try to inform you as soon as possible and also from the same day the registration for counseling will start by paying 5000 on the website you can register that is for first phase up to uh, 28 you can pay and uh, thereafter the choice filling will be done and for second phase also there will be time around uh, second week of the uh, may and uh, similarly the uh, third phase fourth phase that is phase and one student will be eligible for only one phase suppose let me explain it in detail that is rank 1 to 20,000 will be doing first phase if there will be some criteria applied on you you may do the phase 2 also but otherwise 99 percent you can say that you will not be eligible for phase 2 but if you want to do the smart counseling there i will be helping you once you register with my guidance as i am doing it from last five years and many students already registered with my guidance as they have their examination done so if you want you can contact me there is a nominal chart but you will be getting everything first and foremost thing is that you will be connected to me until you get into the college and it is not only for vit but for other entrance exam also whatever you are appearing i will be guiding you for each entrance exam counseling so that you will get the best out of your result in each of them and sideways you can check the detail about my counseling uh, as well that is i have provided you the uh, photo uh, so the, that will be provided to you and choice filling decision making everything will be provided to you by me you just need to be connected with me and you can call me text me any time on the given number you can contact me or you can contact using the description number as well as instagram id as well so first of all if your rank is up to twenty thousand, you will be doing phase one similarly for 20 to forty five thousand, phase two 45 to seventy thousand, phase three phase and category are two different things don't be confused phase and category are two different things phase means the time schedule in which you will be doing the counseling category means the fee category category one two three four five are starting from two lakh up to five lakh i will provide you a detailed information regarding the category wise fee structure of different type of branches as well as the placement record also of each branch so please try to subscribe the channel so you will get that video very soon in the same channel so now if you talk about the phase two then 25 to uh, 45 and 45 to 70 third phase and uh, 70 to 1 lakh fourth phase and above 1 lakh all students will be doing the fifth phase of the counseling process so if your rank is under 1 lakh then only you can take the admission in VIT Valor or Chennai if your rank is above 1 lakh then you will be able to get the college like VIT Bhopal or VIT Amravati so now if you talk about the marks versus rank that I have already discussed in my previous video you can check the in the i button as well in the description box and also you will get the safe rank for category 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 for CSE, CSE specialization and other branches as well for Bellur, Chennai, Amravati as well as the uh, Bhopal campus. So that will help you a lot but counseling is very important it is choice filling in order of that which category you should put at which place everything I will be providing to you that is complete pdf after talking with you because some student wants to get the best branch even with fifth category also okay some student wants to get category one even with any type of branch so there should be a balance between those two because it is not a business or anything it is about your career so you have to take the right decision only otherwise you may face a problem even after paying lots of money to the vit so everything will be taken care by me whether you do phase one counseling phase two phase three phase four or phase five and suppose if you do phase one counseling there will be the student up to 20,000. Suppose if the rank is closed up to 18,000 for a uh, suppose a computer science of third category or fourth category. I'm just giving you an example for detail. You can check my video how much rank you should have to get third category, fourth category. But suppose 18,000 is a closing rank and 19, 20,000 will not get the seat. But if there will be some student who will not take the seat, and it is sure every student who got the seat up to 18,000 rank, they will not pay the fee because uh, many students are looking for an IT, triple IT, GFA as well. So what will be done with those seat by VIT? So that seat will be given to the phase two counseling because there is phase two counseling after phase one. 
so even with 19000 rank you will not get the seat and many student with 21000 they will get the seat because they will be eligible for phase 2 so there is some criteria once you register with my guidance i will make you eligible for phase 2 as well if you will not get the seat in phase 1 you will able to do the phase 2 counseling also by that criteria so please try to do the counseling very carefully if you have all the idea you can do it by yourself if you don't have you can contact me anytime through instagram or whatsapp number there is a nominal charge for that i have some problem in my right eyes as you can see but even after that i am uploading the video because many of you all actually all of you have already completed the vit exemption so you are having the uh, tension in your mind when uh, the counseling will be done how to do the counseling what i will get so everything will be taken care by me once you register with my guidance so this was the complete information regarding the counseling process and what you should do next after the exemption of vit so hope you get this information very useful for you so please try to subscribe the channel so that you will be getting all the updated information at the right time in the same channel thank you